It's funny because I'm at my school right now. See, my old school. I graduated in 2009, Enoch. And it's so cute because now that I look back, I'm like, I really matured than what I used to be. Like, people used to call me Jesus Freak, and now I'm different now. I'd be like, heck yes I am, but before I would cry, and I, I'd be like, God, people are so mean, it'd be hard, but I got way mature than that. Now I'm just like, yes I am. I love Jesus, forever will. And I was so different here, I was insecure. I let people walk all over me sometimes, because people didn't believe in God like I did. I should have just always been myself. I should have loved myself for who I was and who God made me to be, and that, that's the best that's the best way to be. To love yourself for who God made you to be, and it doesn't matter what you look like or what you dress like or anything. This world's supposed to get along, but it won't, but Christians, we, we love each other and we get along. That's how we're supposed to, we're just supposed to love and everything. We're supposed to love each other for who we are, not, not by appearance-wise, we're not judgmental. Christians, we love everyone. So interesting being back, in, like, I'm visiting, I rode my bike, my bike. I like getting exercise, but it's so interesting being here. I'm so grateful to God that I got so mature than I used to be. And I've grown, it's wonderful. Now I wish I could do this all over again and be mature and be better than I was. I used to be so insecure and suicidal and everything, and now, thanks to God's grace, it's better than it was, so. It's amazing. I will always forever love Enoch. I love Enoch so much. I had wonderful teachers here. They were a blessing. I love Enoch so much. It's my number one school, I will always say. But I love all the rest of my schools too, but Enoch's I graduated from. And my uh, sophomore, junior, and senior year were here. And then graduated in 2009. I love it so much. I'm glad I grew up to be who I am. Even if through the loneliness for being a loner and suicidal here and going through a lot in my life with my family. We had to grow in God and a lot of pain and family and stuff, my mother's sickness and everything. Throughout it all, God's grace, He had led me here and now I'm going to be 21. Yes. I'm 2011 right now, May 2011, as I'm speaking. I'm going to be 21 soon, so I'm getting bigger. Still no bandmates yet, but I know the glory that God's going to bring them. So it's so wonderful. I like visiting here. It's so amazing. And everything. Thank God so much for growing up and maturing. And I'm actually grateful for the pain I went through here. Being a suicidal, being a loner. Because if I wasn't alone, then I wouldn't know how people felt. And I'm really grateful for it because now I know how it feels. And now I want to go help other people because it's not right to be alone. And this world should be together, and that's what I'm going to do with my band. I'm going to make sure that everybody feels loved and are together. Because we all love one another, just like God loved everybody. We're supposed to love everybody, and I love everybody, so it's going to be amazing. And everything. Woo! I like showing you my school because it's so beautiful. And I was, I was checking out the gum on the floor. Just wanted to see that. Because a lot of kids don't throw gum on the floor. Jeez. Don't do that. Throw it in the trash can because you make the floor so ugly. See, look at right there, too. You make the floor so ugly, and I was like, oh, I hope they don't run the school just yet with all its ugliness, but yeah. This is my school. Well, my old school, I keep saying that cause it's so hard. It's like I love this school so much. Yeah. Well, thank you for listening. Bye-bye.